What is going on guys, my name is Arbuckle, welcome back to another video. Today I actually want to discuss a little bit about an old easter egg that was found on this map a while back, the barcode easter egg. Um, and I want to talk about what it means and what this means for future easter eggs and other hidden notes around the map. Uh, but before I get into the video, I really want to say that I understand that the zombie community is very serious and takes this uh, very serious. And, and I, I've been in the zombie community for a long time, I've always paid attention to zombies, but I, I know that... Zomb people get angry when people make YouTube videos that really don't help towards the Easter egg. They're just kind of talking about old stuff. Uh, but today I actually wanted to bring this to your attention because this is something that I really think is cool and would lead to more Easter eggs on the map, the giant, and, and other maps to come. Um, so we know that the barcode Easter egg, if you don't know, there's actually a hidden barcode in Teleporter A. If you walk into the teleporter and look up in the back, you can see a barcode. And that was found closer when the game first came out. And they actually figured out that it says... Um, the mountain must be searched for the frozen one. Now, everyone tends to just go crazy, right? Everybody's talking about future maps. What could this mean? Blah, 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 blah. Now, let me take you back a little bit. Treyarch actually has done several interviews where they've talked about how the community basically writes the story ourselves. Like, we take it so much further than they would have ever imagined. I remember in an interview uh, back at, like, a couple months ago, one of the events, they said that before they even gave voices to the characters on the original World at War map, um, the, the community was writing the storyline before they even had a storyline. So what they've said is that like the community will come up with all these crazy ideas and what Treyarch does is they add on to them just to add more to the story and they use the community to basically write the story for them and I think that's so cool that they allow us to do that and that we can expand our imagination and creativity to do something like that. So that being said, I don't think that what they put in this game is meant to go beyond crazy. Now obviously there's crazy easter eggs, but basically what I'm trying to say is is that with a, a barcode that's that easy to find, I don't think we're going to look into future DLC maps. I don't think we're talking about something absolutely crazy. Honestly, what I think we're talking about is think about it. The mountain must be searched for the frozen one. I'm pretty sure we're talking about the perk that we found that's hidden under the mound of snow. I mean, think about it. The mountain of snow must be searched for the frozen one. The frozen one is the perk machine. It's the Deadshot Daiquiri of the Stamina, whichever one's going to be under there in your game. And I think that that is definitely what it is hinting towards because if it was something else, I feel like the barcode will be more hidden, somewhere that's crazier and harder to find. Um, which, which leads me to this. This is kind of really what I wanted to go into was that there's other hidden things on this map like the, the brick video I showed you. There's a hidden code. There's actually another hidden code on a back wall that I'm going to show you in a future video. I think that that also involves into this map the giant and will lead us to other easter eggs within the map. I think that those are kind of like clues that are put in the map to help us find hidden easter eggs. And I really, I, f I feel so strongly about that and I don't want people to get upset and think that I'm stupid and don't know what I'm talking about. Because I think this is clear that this barcode leads to this hidden perk that was supposed to help us out when finding the hidden perk. Um, it, would, it pretty much said, it's like look there's something under there, try to figure out how to get it out. Um, and I think that these other codes that are hidden within the map are going to hint towards the same thing. Not necessarily future maps. Uh, but anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, let me know in the comments below what you guys think. I really think that this could be what this is. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see all you guys in the next video. Now we